Okay, this how-to video is going to talk about uh, shape connection types to pins inside the Cadence PCB Editor tools. It's available in all levels of the tools. Um, so there's, there's several different ways to control how a, a pin is connected to a shape. So um, by default, there's a shape, global dynamic parameters. Um, we've got a thermal relief connects tab, and we can control effectively globally how the through pins, SMD pins, and vias are connected to a, uh, a shape. I can obviously do that globally. I can also do that, so if I use the shape, select shape or void, pick the shape, and do a right-click parameters. I can then control that specifically on a shape-by-shape -shape basis, so this would then override the global settings. Um, I can also do that on a pin and a via. So what I can do is if I hover over a pin or a via, um, we can do a right-click and we can use the property edit feature. I'm looking for a property called DIN Therm Con Type, so DIN Thermal Connection Type. Um, and I've got an assign button which basically allows me to control which connection types based on which layers. And I can obviously do it based on all. I can do the outer layers, the plane layers, the signal layers. So, um, and I have the same options that I have in the, the global and the, the individual shapes. So I, if I wanted to make maybe the, the top layer an orthogonal base connection, the ground layer can be a diagonal, um, inner one, full contacts. Let's do full contacts. I haven't got connections on this one, but we'll make diagonal, um, and we'll do an orthogonal on this one. If I click OK there and then apply, obviously those properties get set, so that we can then just work our way through looking at the individual pin. The connections are obviously different based on the control here.